Okay, today's drill is called the pull drill, and in it we're gonna be having a, it's a four ball fed drill for your singles play. Um, we're gonna be working on opening up the court and using those high percentage shots. So it's a series of four balls, but I also like to use it in a succession of eight if you're really trying to develop the idea of constructing longer points. But for today's purpose, we're just gonna start off with those four balls. So the first ball you get is gonna be a forehand pulled out wide. The second one is a backhand kind of in the middle. The third one is a backhand pulled out wide. And the fourth ball is gonna be shorter in the court. It's a sitter that hopefully you'll be able to put away. So when I'm working with my students on these on, on this drill, what I really like to think of and explain to them is that every ball has a purpose. And in our decision making on court, you can't waste any decision. So each of these shots that we're gonna be hitting is high percentage. It's naturally pulled across your body so that the more that you do this drill, you'll get that kind of um, muscle memory of being able to really have that experience of hitting cross court and instinctually knowing where to hit. And I also like to think of it in terms of the purpose of having the first three balls be have, having the intention of setting up the point with the last ball with the intention of ending the point. So we're so gonna start off with Ian pulling him out wide. He pulls it cross court. He stops in the middle and he's gonna hit the backhand cross court. Again, he's out wide and he's gonna finish the point inside in with that forehand. All right, so this is a great, great drill. It's a fundamental concept, working on those high percentage balls and letting you really experience being able to construct the point and end it intelligently.